All right, guys, we're playing some uh, Tristana top lane. And the plan this game is that we're going to go for a all hit setup. We're going to be going for probably Kraken Slayer into maybe Hurricane. Go for like an AoE damage build. As well as like playing Tristana top. It's one of the one of the more interesting picks because Tristana actually counters like 90% of all the top laners. And you get to like scale up very safely, so... You'll see how, how good this is. You will see. Um, in short, we got the Lethal Tempo, Presence, Alacrity, Cutdown, we got Demolish, and Bone Plating. Let's see if we can all in right here. Ah, not getting the auto attack off. It's fine, though. Took a little bit too much damage from the tower, but it's fine. <clears throat> I'm not scared about Sange, like, being able to approach me. Even if he slows me with W and flings me, like, I should still be okay. Pretty nice shove. Let's walk up here. Okay. I think that Lee Sin is pathing towards topside, so if Zack is going to go for the jungle camp, then I'll likely be able to um, go for like the two versus one, being able to win it. Oh, Lee Sin's actually in mid. Okay. Also, what's fun about Tristana is like every single time that you're going to go for an auto on, on the wave and your opponent like walks up towards it, your AoE damage is actually going to poke him. Which it results in some pretty... Oh. Actually. Did he survive? No. He didn't. Not bad. Not bad, man. Okay. So first things first. We're gonna go for... Berserker's Griefs. And... The... Made item we're gonna go with is gonna be Kraken Slayer. That's gonna be for sure. There's no doubting it. Like this game, we definitely don't need anything other than Kraken Slayer. We can go for Shield Bow, but there's no reason to do it because they do have burst, but it's not needed. Um, I think what would fit the build pretty well is going for Hurricane because it provides us the crit movement speed for kiting as well as the AoE damage for clear we'll see but that's what i'm thinking maybe blade of the rune king would also be a very good option here drop that down we should be able to out trade him Ah, too bad. Not today, I suppose. Nice. Okay, let's go back. Oh? Actually, now nah, it's not gonna kill him, I'm pretty sure. It's gonna make him live. Take the wave. Nice. We'll just take like one play and then we back out. Oh, I had no mana, bro. And he walked into my, uh, basically inside of the range of my W, so my W landed. I did not auto attack it. Let's go back. Yeah, let's go for a... This one. Just going for pickaxe immediately, because I, I want to have the, the pickaxe ready for the next time. 
because it's really hard purchase sometimes. Want to make sure I get it. Let's hook top. So far, like farming wise, we have a uh, double the farming lead. We also have level six. It's got level five. Plus, we have a plate. We nearly have two plates actually. Check this out. Got sack ready. And there we go. Let's shove this. Honestly, man, like playing Shasana top lane, um, especially when you're playing against a immobile champion like Singed, just feels so good to play. And Shastana also allows you like um, to shred towers down as you're winning the lane phase. Let's place a ward down. Hmm. Well, I'm in, in the trail. Yeah. <laughs> Not badly played at all. I am not gonna lie to you. I jumped in with the intention of just hitting an auto as soon as I land, but he walked in the brush. I didn't have vision in there because I placed my ward here. Not bad, man. It would have made the difference. That's okay, whatever. I hope he's not gonna get any plates. Yeah, thankfully he doesn't go for plates. Or, I'm not even losing the... Yeah, I'm not even... Yeah, okay, I did get the XP, I just lost the cannon, that's all. Let's go for the tower. I think he's gonna come back with armor. lose all of it. Do actually get an auto for the E. The more autos you can get, the better, obviously. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Well, yeah, there goes my ghost, I guess. I think Lee Sin's gonna walk around. I feel like he's baiting. I think he is. I think he is. I think that's a Lee Sin up here. An enemy has been slain. Double kill. Yeah, I told you. I told you there is. See? Nice. I told you, man. Like a singe, like walking up to you with like what, like. Uh, 200 HP? Yeah, you're joking. You're not being serious, if I see it. <laughs> this is way too obvious. Let's, um, let's go back here. Let's go back right there. We're gonna go for Kraken Slayer, then we're gonna go for Hurricane. Hurricane is not typically an item that you see on a daily basis on Tristana, but again, I don't think it's bad, especially because the more levels you make it to the late game, the better your range is going to be, the longer range it's going to be. It's going to be much easier to hit the Hurricane as well. Let's get it. Nice. 
Okay, let's go back top. See you later, buddy. <laughs> and after we push, yeah, we'll try and get her again. We need like 1,200 more. So we still have some farming to do. Nice. I think Lee Sin is pathing top lane. Just to be sure, I'm just going to back here instead of uh, right there in case Lee Sin's going to jump across. <clears throat> you never know. Ooh, I like, the look of this, baby. like, it becomes extremely gankable for your opponent uh, or whoever it might be if you're, if you're casting W to clear a wave because W is my only... Well, it's not my only way of like disengaging, but if I previously use my ultimate and I only have W left and I cast it for a wave clear, it's very tempting for my opponent to just walk up and try and gank it or try and kill me or whatever. Because my W is a pretty long cooldown. It's like 20 seconds cooldown. 22 specifically, if I don't reset it in some kind of way. I think he might be baiting. An enemy has been slain. Double kill. I just need a Is he baiting? I feel like he does. I am not gonna jump. I don't know. I feel like if I hit if I if I hit my W, I feel like Lee Sin's gonna jump around. Like jumping from uh, out of vision or something. I don't know. Should I try? I'm gonna do it. Let's see here. Okay. Maybe maybe Lee Sin was here previously, I guess. I don't know. An ally has been slain. Yep, there he is. Oh, I should be able to kill him now. I still have my Q available for a ton of attack speed, but I think that Lee Sin can burst me because he has lethality. So I'm just going to back put here instead. Unstoppable. Nice. Let's uh, walk up to the jungle camp right there. Let's get it. Oh, they went for a surrender. <laughs> Just on a top lane is is like such a genius pick, honestly. It's been it's been such a good pick, but also, um, it's been one of the meta champions back in the day. It's still being recognized as a good top laner, just it's just not being played very often, but it's still a very good top laner. But uh, either way, this is just on a top. Thanks so much for watching today's video, and I'll see you next time. Peace.